How's it going, guys? This is Dragon Fist 900. Bringing you guys another episode of Jedi Knight Jedi Academy. Now, where we left off, we basically arrived at. I believe this place is called Vast Castle. So, yeah. Um, we slayed these two. Those two troopers there, and we cannot step out in the rain for very long, or else, we'll, or else we will take severe damage. Like for some strange reason, I guess the acid, I guess the rain here must have been bathed in cosmic rays, or um, and dark side force energy, because it is doing severe damage. And oh my, oh god, that's a powerful weapon. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, okay, don't. Okay, 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 okay. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh, that's baloney. That's baloney. Okay, low checkpoint. Great. Yeah, Kyle looks like he's sick, but yeah, guys, we can't be out in the rain for that long because of the acid and stuff. So, and that, and that means that we have to take out these guys again. Hate these guys. The weapon, the weapons are awesome, but at the same time, I don't like them. Hey, where's your lightsaber? <laughs> Dang it! Here we go again. Blah 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 blah. I need to learn how to quick save. Well, I mean, if not quick save, then just, um... Looks like the welcome wagons arrived. I mean, like, I don't really... I don't know if there's a way to input cheats or anything, but... That'd be pretty... Like, I know there's a cheat for, like, infinite health, but we could make this level of breeze. Of breeze, given the, um... Given the rain problem that we're having right now. No, you will not get me again. You will not get me again. Come on, come on. Okay, okay. Oh, and it looks like we got one of his weapons. I wonder what it does. I'll, I'll test it out on an enemy later, I guess. But yeah, guys, um, I... I recently watched the entire Star Wars The Clone Wars series. Um, on Cartoon Network, or actually no, on Netflix. Um, both on. Uh, well, I watched both series, the 2003 one and the um, 2000. I, I believe the 3D one came out in 2008. Well, actually no, the CG one came out in 2008. Um, and that ran until 2014, so that's a, that's a really long running time, even for, even for your children's cartoon. Although granted, it's not done by Power Rangers, but Power Rangers isn't. In the cartoon, it's a, um, it's a TV show. Okay, so we let's just like Kyle handle it. Because I, I don't, because Kyle doesn't really have a health bar and he can't really die. At least I don't think. Plus, he's a Jedi Master, so we should be able to take that thing down with ease, with relative ease. Oh, good. Never mind. He has a face. Oh wow. What? How the heck? Are Wow, so how did our lightsabers make the how did our lightsaber ma make those troopers disintegrate? Okay, so we're inside. That's good. Actually, I'm just gonna go ahead and save, that way we don't have to go through that process again. Although I meant Although I may just forget to load to load the same game, but that's just something I forget to do frequently. So, <laughs> yeah, also, guys, I, I recently ordered a um a Spider-Man game for a future L LP. I'm not gonna spoil which one it is. Just know that it's one of the better ones in the um, in the franchise. And no, it's not Spider-Man 2 for PC. That game sucks. 
is notoriously hated for, by fans and, and critics alike for not only not for them, not only. Oh! Wait, was Kyle just using voice lightning? Oh, come on, 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 come Okay, okay, I, I, feel, I feel quite, um, I feel quite powerful now. Only that that power you're taking away from me. Darn it. Yeah, but, um, I mean, I recently, um, yeah, like I was saying, but Sp Spider Man 2, it's hated by. Oh wow, that is nice. It's hated by fans and critics alike to be on the Spider-Man 2 game PC because it's one, it's unlike any of the console versions, and two, they, and two, they just didn't bother to make a PC point. How hard would it have been to make the, to make one? I mean, I, I don't really know much about game development, but I do, but I do know that making points of, ga of games is relatively easy, um, depending on whether or not the developer. Ha has the um has an on um, oh sorry Kyle depending on whether or not the um the developer has yeah Kyle is using force lightning but wow that's a good Death Star that's weird I thought it could be a planet but um yeah but I mean I don't really know that much about ga about game development but I do know that. Making a point can be can be extremely easy depending on whether or not um, the publisher has um, I believe I believe it depends on whether or not the developers ha have um have the You're joking, right? Have um Have an unlimited, have an unlimited amount of time. That's what, that's what I was gonna say. But yeah, I mean, Spider-Man 2 was just so lazily designed. Not the console ver version. The console version is amazing. I played it several times, and it's freaking it's freaking fantastic. But the PC version is just crud, in my opinion. It's just total crud. Now, if they made a PC port, then none of the creation would be happening. But, but yeah, just let you guys know, I am I am not going to be playing a button game. It's going to be a spiny game, but it's not going to be, um, any of the movie like this game. Okay, I kind of spoiled it there a little bit, but... Okay, let's just continue on in this adventure of ours. Ooh, you should check... Checkpoint. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Almost got a headshot in. Oh! How dare you fire at us! Where'd Kyle go? If he's hurt. You should run. You've been what? What are you waiting for? Oh, okay. Wow! We jumped high. We can't stay out here forever, Kyle. Plus, you're gonna die. Plus, your AI is gonna die, probably. I'm, I'm, I don't really know how. I don't really know how good other AIs were in, in games at the time of Jedi Academy's release. But Kyle's AI seems to be pretty confident in following you around and stuff, and not setting up setting up traps, unlike the ones in um. And other oh, RPGs oh, and stuff oh, that were made after oh, this. Although, granted, this isn't oh, an RPG, but still. Oh, 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 sorry, Kyle. Oh, 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 Come on, oh, get him, get him, get him. Oh, 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 wow. That was extremely ah, easy. Ah, Just one hit KO'd him. Ah, or. Or. Actually, no, we hit him. Actually, no, we hit him with our lightsaber. Oh, so this is the other side. Oh, hello there. 
And, he, and this guy is just letting us kill him. He's just going to just raise him until he's flash away at his, at his life and at his body until he has nothing left. But it's what? And this guy too. I mean, the stormtrooper is like stormtrooper. Is like, okay, this proves what everyone's known. Stormtroopers are friggin' morons. That is what they have always been. That is what they always will be. I mean, well, someone a someone asked me um, a few weeks, a few days back what um what I thought the story was prequel. And if they if they if they even held a candle up to the originals, and I mean, well, okay, I grew up with the prequels. Okay, I'm I'm not one of the I'm not one of the quote unquote lucky generation who met joking, who managed right? to kept, who managed to be born and grow up during the, during the time period in which the original trilogy was first spawned. But I do know that like the prequels do do something that, like like they hold a kick. I hold, a I hold a candle up to the original in, t in terms of quality. Well, I mean, I mean, not really the first and second, but the third one definitely because um, it reveals the origin of Darth Vader, like the actual origin of Vader himself. Although the second and third one, though, they're just, I mean, I think they're just one giant toy advertisement. Kind of like Batman and Robin. The um, uh, the one with George Clooney in it. I don't really. I think it was 1987. That was made. But but it, it's commonly called a giant toy commercial. But anyway, um, back on track. Basically, the um, the prequels hold a candle up to the original in quality and somewhat in acting. Now when I say somewhat, I mean that only two characters really get to shine in my book, and that is, and that, and that is um, Ewan McGregor, who plays Obi-Wan Kenobi in all three films, and um, and Ian McDermott, who plays Emperor Palpatine, and eventually, who plays Chancellor and eventually Emperor Palpatine. Um, but I mean, I mean, by the end of the third movie, you're really starting to think of Sir Alec Guinness, who played the original Obi-Wan in Episode 4 A New Hope. I mean, yeah, like, Star Wars, the, um, the franchise is just something that's... Well, 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 I mean, not so much the whole franchise and, and then of itself, but... Yeah, I thought you were What the heck? I don't... Okay, Kyle, how have you not turned to the dark side? Although, granted, his, his, only, his only dark side power would... would be Force Lightning, but still. Ooh, I'm wondering... Um... I'm wondering about um, trying something, actually. Because there's, there's a character in the expanded, in the expanded universe that called, called Dark Revan. And... He's featured in the Knights of the Old Republic game and, and, and in a couple of MMOs. Um, but I, I'm, I'm wondering whether or not um, we can channel both the light and the dark side of the Force in our group set. I mean, that would be awesome. We kind of we kind of be like the anti-hero or something like that. Like that, like that would be great. I did not mean to do that. Okay. Hmm. Where to next? How do we shoot the blade? I don't get it. Yeah. Uh, I just don't get it. <laughs> 